Hello everyone, this is BCS Buster and welcome back to Let's Play Mother 3. Last time, we made it to the Valley of the Mr. Saturns. Yay, the Saturn Valley. I love this place and I love the Mr. Saturn people. We also rescued them from the Pig Warriors and we got Duster back on our team. So it was a very eventful episode and a lot of great stuff happened. So we are doing really great shape. Or we are in really great shape. All right. Well, now we need to go through this cave. This hole. Ooh, the fire mountain. They said we needed to go up there. Let's go ahead and head up there. So it kind of, once again, splices the, uh, the themes together. Ooh, smooth after the bath. Well, that's nice. Yes. Uh, zoom, zoom. Isn't that from a commercial? Only five can ladder. Now, if you tried to come here earlier, uh, you wouldn't be able to go up here. This place would be off limits, I think. Either this place or other places coming up where that would be off limits. So, oh good, they can climb. K.O. K.O. Tip top. Oh, Mr. Saturns. Oh, that's a girl, Mr. Saturn. So is that a Mrs. Saturn? I don't know. And we get another cup of life noodles. Excellent. So what that does is we, uh, removes all negative status and fully heals capacity. So it's basically like a secret herb. So, that's a good thing. Let's definitely heal up. There we go. Very good. Alright. Yes. Wash the exhaust off. Apparently it also washes Dakota off. North Dakota or South Dakota? I don't know. But anyway, here's the item guy. Yes, let's go ahead and drop off an item. And I want to get rid of the rubber cape, because we don't need that. Huh? And I believe we're good on everything else. Yeah, I may end up throwing, getting rid of some of these sprinting bombs and stuff like that a little bit later on. Yep. Okay. We're good. Yep. Awesome. Well, thanks, buddy. I appreciate that. Okay, let's keep on moving. Ooh, and another, another chest. Great. All of the farting boxes in this area. Ugh. Fire mountain above the cliff. Great. But how the heck are we gonna get up there? Dang it! Well, the wall, it's too, it's all for the wall staples. Itty bitty wait before going up. Okay. How exactly are they gonna do this? Uh oh, it's some Mr. Saturns. Oh! And they built a ladder for us. Terrific. Wait, are they wanting us to climb on their faces? Can we do that? Okay. Hmm. Oh, yeah, because they only can have five. Remember what, the, what they said from below? Duster, what you got, buddy? K.O. K.O. Barley T. What? Shoe prints in face, boing. Oh, sweating Mr. Saturn. <laughs> yeah! Oh! And Duster goes all ninja on him. Very good. And we just step on the Mr. Saturn's faces to get up. Excellent. Uh oh. Fun! <laughs> That's great. Good job, Mr. Saturns. Good job, indeed. All right, let's go. Yeah, and we should, you shouldn't need to go down for any reasons once you've uh, taken care of everything. I think you can go back down. I'll double check that, but. All right, let's go ahead and save. All right. Um, by the way, uh, I double checked and I'll show you this. You can't actually go down. So, make sure you have everything that you need before heading up. But, you should be good to go. Alright, let's rock and roll. We won't be able to head back down for a while, but that's okay. Alright, let's take a look around. Let's see what we got here. Hey, it's another one of those mole cricket shops. Oh, terrific. We're at the forefront of business evolution. <laughs> that's great. Sure, let's take a look and see what they got. Yeah, there's nothing that we need. Uh, it's basically just some healing items and... 
all that good stuff. Sincerity dumplings, uh, that's great. And you can just take it, use your imagination to what kind of dumplings. All right, so apparently they want us just like the frogs to, uh, to uh, give regards, but hmm, a boulder's blocking the way. Well, crap. I guess let's uh, see what we got here. Hey, it's another one of the gypsies' houses. Chem and ILT. All right. Let's uh, talk to this person here. Sleep talking. And this is Phrygia. Slocking? Sure. Oh, letter from Phrygia. Sure. Very good. Oh, I see. Hey, they knew I would be coming. How did they know that? Oh, okay, excellent. Okay, excellent. Oh, yeah. What? What does that mean? And smoochy smoochy? Uh, I'm just gonna leave that one alone. Well, we get some encouraging words. Excellent. I don't know how this is gonna, the encouraging words is gonna help us move the boulder, but we shall soon see. Uh-huh. Oh. What the? Whoa! The boulder just moved! And is now standing up on its head. Well, that's great. That's just lovely. Alright. Let's keep moving forward here. Alright, see what we got here. A horizontal boulder. The boulder won't budge at all. Oh! Now this is kind of like a mini puzzle game. So... The boulders will move based on which, whichever direction, the opposite direction that you want them to go. So, just do it in this order. They move out of the way. And we're good to go. Now we're in the next area. We got a new enemy here, the Sky Tatney. Oh, nice. Um, this being a... A, uh... Fire area. Everybody here is weak to ice, so Kumator is going to be your best friend here. Oh, nice. Very good. Ooh, good amount of experience. Okay, now unfortunately there isn't a map around here, so let's just. Yeah, I guess I'll show up this enemy too. We got a new enemy here, Mrs. Lava. I kind of feel bad beating up a Mrs. Lava, but oh well. There you go. Ow. Yeah, and you definitely want to try and beat every enemy here in this area because we need to get experience as quickly as we can. Because one, we need to get Duster caught up. Plus, we just need to do that. And we get a pencil rocket. Excellent. Probably should use those at some point. All right. Just keep moving along here. Ooh, double jerky. Terrific. Wait a minute. Pig warriors. What about him? Uh, all right. Oh, wow. Oh, no. Horns? Wait. Is he trying to transform him like the guy in Ninja Gaiden 3? Clancy, I think, was his name. What? All right, fine. Okay, let's see. Um, so against these guys, these guys are really not that hard. Let's just go, um, yeah, all in fact, you just need to use PSI Alpha. And you should be fine. Fine. Yep. Because you want to save some of your beta for uh, the upcoming attacks, or the upcoming battle. Ow. Come on, finish him off. Got him! Very nice. Woo! A lot of experience points. And a level for Kumatora. Excellent. And a level for Duster. Excellent. Yeah, you suck, pig mask warriors. Alright, let's keep moving. Whoa! All 
Alright, another level for Lucas. Excellent. And another level for Boney. Fantastic. Alright, let's keep on moving. Ooh, another chest. Excellent. And we get a cup of life noodles. Fantastic. Oh boy. Yeah, you gotta watch out for those Mrs. Lavas. They can use PSI, PSI Fire Gamma on you. That can do like 100 damage to all of your party, so that's... That's crazy. Now don't be afraid to use your PSI, and I'll show you why here in just a little bit. All right, let's keep going through the cave here. And we got a new enemy here, the Pyrefly. Now you will take those guys out second. You wanna start by taking out the uh, Mrs. Lava first because of that PSI fire gamma attack. Well, they both can breathe fire. There you go. Yeah, watch this. Yeah, this is the attack here. You gotta watch out for it. Oh my god, that just kicked your ass. Wow, I need to heal up after that one for sure. Okay, I'm gonna have to go fast here. There you go. Got him. Whew! That was close. Yeah, 1300 experience. We're doing good. Okay, once again, let's heal up. There you go. And very good. All right, let's keep moving here. Uh, okay, let's go down this way first. Uh, how are we doing on? Eh, yeah, we're doing okay. Uh-oh. Oh, we got a new enemy here, the Scampering Mushroom. If there's just one of them, just use physical attacks. Sometimes you have to face all, like there, you might have noticed there's three in the room. Sometimes you might have to face off against all three of them. Ooh, a level for Duster, excellent. If that's the case, ooh, a hot spring egg. Wow, it's like 100 extra HP, that's awesome. Um, if that's the case, then just uh, use the power of the BCS universe. Here, well, here, I'll show you. Now, so, oh. Sometimes Duster gets an extra attack and that's awesome. So if this is in fact the case, uh, what I would do is just use the power of the BCS universe and then fire beta take these guys out quickly. And again, trust me, it's totally okay. Oh, this is the main reason. Because they can feel strange. And that can kick your ass real quickly. And this is the only time we're going to have to deal with these guys in this area. So don't be afraid to take them out real fast. And again, you'll see why it's a totally okay to use uh, the psychic points here in just a little bit. Okay, let's definitely use the healing there against Duster. Go. Okay, let's keep moving here. Now we get a saltwater gun. Could be useful. All right, let's keep moving here. This way, and we want to go to the left first. Oh, oh, okay. Looks like we need another spell. Look at that. Please get that. Ooh, shield omega. Excellent. Um, actually, don't want to take out this thing first. Um, actually, what I'm going to do is draw it out here, and then run around it. There you go. Oh crap, I forgot about this thing. And we got a new enemy here, the Magman. Not to be confused with Mega Man. Same thing as before. Oh, I forgot to heal up Bony. Crap. Whoa! Oh, good. Wow, that thing still didn't die? Okay, uh, let's heal up. Actually, no, you know what? We need to do it this way. Uh, use the power of the BCS universe. And you heal Boney. Everybody else attack. And take out the Magman first, trust me. Okay, hurry up, hurry up, get the Boney's turn. Okay, fine, fine, hurry up, get the Boney's turn. Or Kumatora's turn. Whew! Wow. Got lucky there. And just physical attacks, take these things out. Wow! If you wanted to get some fire resistant equipment, that'd be okay here. Uh, but I don't think we're in this area long enough. Wow! Look at that experience. That was great. Um, but I don't think we're in this area long enough to, to warrant getting that and then. Let me get a secret herb. Uh, and then, you know, getting the defense boost and that sort of thing. So I wouldn't even worry about it. Okay, uh, do we want to go. No, we want to go this way first. 
you would... Okay, the, the two paths connect. Okay, that's fine. Um, okay, can I make it to this area without running into an enemy? Nope. Damn it. Whew! Made it. Now, this is the room that you want to get to. Because once you get to this room on the left, you're safe. That's just gross. Ugh. Now, the reason that we're okay for this room is it is a magic butterfly room. Yeah. You remember what that does? Yeah, that restores everybody's psychic points. Or gets them back. And we get a luxury banana. So this is why it's okay to use all of your uh, psychic points to get to this point. Because... Oops. No, he's out. Boy. Um, actually, let's just use beta. It's fine. Uh, there. And that should be it. Yep. Okay, so now the deal with the magic butterfly room is, and that was and that was a, a thing in the first game too. So all you need to do is go back in, and the butterfly respawns, and you can get your psychic points back. Yeah, it only restores ten. It restored twenty in the first game, but still, it's basically free healing in the middle of a cave. So that's really cool. So what I'm actually going to do, believe it or not, is I'm going to do a little bit of level grinding at this point because I want to make sure that I'm really strong for what I need to do going ahead. Uh, and I'm actually going to get my characters to about level 40 is the goal. And I, I won't try to o completely overpower, but basically just enough to get the spells that I need. And again, get around level 40 and then before moving forward because the next boss is hard. And not just that, but going forward, uh, you want to be on higher levels. Plus, it's so easy to gain levels in this cave because the enemies give so much experience and they're really not that hard, especially if you have PSI freeze. So I'm going to take care of that real quick and then I will be back once I have leveled up uh, as much as I want to. Just again, it takes a little bit of time, but uh, I promise it is totally worth it in the end. How much more do I have to do here? Ooh, yeah, I got to do this about six, oh, a few more times. So anyways, I will take care of all of this and then I will be back once I have gotten all the levels that I want and I'll go over all my character's new setup once I am done with all of that. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, I've done all the level grinding that I want to, so let's take a look at our new stats here. Uh, I got Lucas up to level 40, just like I said I would, and Lukumatora right behind him at 39, and that's completely fine. Uh, Duster will get his level probably as we approach the next area, and then Boney's at level 40 as well, so. Everything is, re we're moving along really nicely. So I'm very happy about that. I'm very happy about where our stats are and we're gonna need those coming up. So let me go over my new spells for you so you see what we got there. So we've got Healing Gamma, which is really, really, really nice. So not only does it cure all status ailments, but it, we can now revive some of our party members if they go down, so that's good. Offense up Omega is important. I think he gets that level 36, which is something that you definitely wanna have. So I definitely like that. For Kumatora, she's got PK Freeze beta, uh, Gamma, which I think she learns at level 39. Uh, I want to say she learned Paralysis Omega as well. These are the Paralysis or Hypnosis. I don't remember. I'm not going to use either of them. But uh, but there's that there. I don't know why it's giving that me that message or, or giving me uh, defense down twice. It's kind of weird. I think that's a glitch. But either way, we've got some new spells. Most importantly, again, is uh, for her is going to be... P uh, her Thunder Beta is actually what we're going to use the most of. But I will tell you that having Freeze Gamma really helps in this area, for sure. But for the most part, you definitely want to have not only Shield Omega, but Offense Up Omega as well. So, okay, we're all done with that, and now we're ready to finish off exploring the next part of this Fireball Volcano. But will it lead us to the Needle? Or were the Mr. Saturns wrong all along? You have to wait until next time to find out. But then this is BCS Buster signing off. Don't forget to like me on Facebook. Follow me on Twitter, BCS Buster LP. Check out my donations page. And as always, take care of y'all.